Hello, new Commonwealth school families. Brenda is a good friend of mine and she wanted me to introduce myself for a minute and talk to you about kind of my own journey. I too am a homeschooling mom. I've got six kids. We've been going at it for about 20 years. I was lucky enough early on to discover liberal education, uh, classical education. And, you know, looking back, I would have to say that the very best decision I ever made on this whole journey, maybe even as a mom, but definitely as a homeschooler, was to work on my own education. I can't tell you how much I applaud you for where you are and what you're doing. Not very many families will take up the call to take ownership of their family's education in such a, a holistic way as you are attempting to do. And you're absolutely amazing for being willing to take that challenge. And I really identify with some of the things that must be going on in your minds and some of the uh, difficulties that you're facing, some of the things that you feel like you're up against. I really, I've been through so many of those things. And I just wanna tell you, um, Brenda and I were talking and she mentioned that um, some people are telling you that you need to read all the books your children are reading and that you need to go through all the material that your children are going through. And I just kind of wanted to take issue with that because my experience as a homeschool mom, my experience in working on a master's in education and studying the great educators of history, and my experience just being in co-ops and having you know lots and lots of homeschool friends is, it's impossible. Don't even try. <laughs> you know, it's it's not gonna happen. You don't have time. Maybe if you have one or two kids, maybe if you spent all your time doing it, there might be some hope of making that happen. But it's really not gonna happen. So if if we live in an information age and we have all this incredible information we want to give to our children, you know, what are we gonna do if we can't make it through all the information, all the different uh, that the, all of our different ages of children are trying to get through, the answer is simple. We just focus on skills. Skills are something that you can acquire and they're something that you can pass on. And as you have passion for what you're doing, as you share a vision with your children of why you're homeschooling and what you're trying to accomplish, you can work on your own skill set and then you can pass that skill set onto your children. Now, what are some of the most important skills that we need in the modern world. Well, if we're gonna stay faith-based, we need the skills of being able to match the secular with the spiritual, right? And we need the skill of understanding natural laws and true principles because they're the backbone of every religious tradition. They're the backbone of morality and they are the truly spiritual element of life. And so what you can do is learn what principles are and learn how to build a principle-centered home. In my book that many of you got called The Mission Driven Life, I talk about those four foundational laws of life mission. And if you're trying to build a mission-driven home, it has to be principle-centered. And it has to be education-focused in terms of reading the greats, which is, of course, exactly what you're trying to do. What are some other skills you can acquire? You can acquire the skill of asking great empowering questions. Instead of lecturing all the time, when you draw, you, you ask your children questions instead, you draw answers from them and you make them problem solvers. You can um, gain the skill of creating a great learning environment by knowing how to lead powerful discussions. Whether it's discussions of your scripture or books or experiences your family's having or um, some kind of science experiment you did or something that's happening at your co-op, leading powerful discussions is one of the most important skills every mom should have in order to really guide her family and help them to learn to be influential thinkers and influential speakers and help them to put their thoughts into words so that they have good communication skills. There's all kinds of studies that show that communication skills are one of the most important skills for success in life. So over this educational journey and personal journey of my own and with my children and as a homeschooling mom, this is kind of the truth that I've come to and I've seen it work over and over and over again. And luckily over the past several years, I've had the opportunity of putting these skill sets on paper and teaching them in seminars, teaching them in online classes, teaching them at conventions and the, the effect of these simple skills has been phenomenal to watch. 
And so I just want to let you know You've kind of been exposed to Mission Driven Mom. Uh, you may have read The Mission Driven Life or read part of it so far. And uh, Brenda wanted me to just mention to you some of the things that we do at The Mission Driven Mom. Now, you can continue to engage with us for free. You can listen to the podcast. You can join the Mission Driven Mom Mastermind Facebook group where we do an after the podcast discussion and we post inspiring stuff and talk about it. And we do Facebook Lives and things like that. Um, you can spend more time in that book and you can work toward having a more principle centered and mission driven home. If you want to go a step further, um, you can do this personally, or you can do it in your co-ops and, and you can engage with us in the mission driven mom Academy, the MDM Academy. And in, in that environment, you know, it's its whole website and there's a workbook and there's all kinds of cool tools. And Brenda can answer some of your questions because she's been involved with us. Um, the moms are having a phenomenal experience. And this is what the MDM Academy is all about is teaching you these skills. Now they're for everyone. Any mom, you know, really needs these skills, but especially a homeschool mom, it's invaluable. You know, you're not just doing it at home. You're doing it in your in, in your commonwealth, you know, you're running classes, you need to know how to mark a book, you need to know the five types of questions. And then you need some of these deeper life skills that you can pass on to your children in terms of knowing real needs versus real wants and how to meet your own needs. If you don't meet your needs as a homeschool mom, forget it, nobody's needs are gonna be met. And we talk about the victim cycle and what the opposite of that is. And we talk about how to see yourself and others in a, in a true light. Self-discovery, we focus on strengths rather than weaknesses, discovering your strengths. We do a whole bunch of different self-discovery exercises that you can do with your children and help them discover their strengths so they can build on those talents and abilities and, and find careers and fulfilling outlets for their talents to serve the community, to serve their families in the future. We read incredible novels and principles are delineated in every section of the MDM Academy and you find those principles in the readings. And then later on in level two, we tutor you in exactly how to find principles in everything you're reading. And it's just, it's been, it's been such a joy to study and learn these things over the last 20 years to then put them into programs and test them out on many, on many individuals and families and watch watch their success, watch the way that they transform families. And I just want to invite you, Brenda and I have worked out a really special deal for you. And the, in the coming weeks, I'm going to be doing a live class for you for free and answer your questions and give you more information. If this is something you might want to consider doing in your Commonwealth or individually, I want to invite you to check that out. In the meantime, please go check out the podcast and join our Facebook group and become part of our community of moms, because I can tell you some of the very top notch women are in uh, that forum. They are incredible. They are on the ball. They are um, women full of faith and dedication to themselves and their families. And, and it does me a world of good to associate with them. They really inspire me and make me want to be better. But it was fun to introduce myself. Good luck in your journey. Uh, it will be phenomenal. It will change you in unbelievable ways. And I, I'm sure many of you have already experienced that, but but it has changed my whole life to be a homeschool mom and, and commonwealths are totally the way to go to build the community that you and your kids need. Anyway, check, uh, check out the podcast, um, get involved, and hopefully I'll meet you in the Facebook group.